I want him out of here. What were you thinking? I can't believe you let this man stay with you, with Leo there. She's making this seem worse than it is. He broke into my house. Oh, I didn't break into any house. Your friend let me in. And he grabbed me. I wanted to talk. That's not a crime, is it? Oh, and by the way, why don't you ask to see her mobile? <gasps> He's crazy. He needs help. So you're saying I imagine the calls and the message? What calls? Uh, he stole my phone. So much for those two not being close. Who? Rakesh. Well, he's been calling her since yesterday, trying to talk to her, panicking in case she says something. And he pretty much came out and said that he wants rid of me. Of course he wants rid of you. Look at you. Look at how you're behaving. And I know why he's been calling Vanessa. He, he wants to open a savings account for Johnny. He was worried that she wouldn't agree. That's all. He asked me to talk to her. I don't know what to say. Try sorry. I don't want to hear it. I know I've not been thinking straight. But can you not see how it looked from my point? No, I can't. Because I'm not paranoid. You know, the only reason I haven't called the police is because I don't know whether you need arresting or sectioning. Just leave. Come on. Uh, Rona? I am not kidding. He needs help. I know he does. And right now, I'm all he's got. <coughs> Drink this. What's happening to me? Nothing. You're still grieving. I keep thinking. Police car's coming. Vanessa won't do that. I wouldn't blame her if she did. I don't know who that person was in that room. I swear it wasn't me. I know the feeling. How is this happening? You stumble across an affair and the world looks different forever, doesn't it, eh? Can't imagine trusting anyone ever again. Sorry that I pushed you away. If anybody should have understood, had a bit more empathy. This insanity. I've been taking it out on everybody except the person I'm really angry with. Because I can't. Come on. What? I've got an idea. <laughs> 